Now, as the trade war between the U.S. and China escalates, President Trump has warned there's a lot more he could do to hurt China's economy. For more on this and other news from around the world, let's turn uh, to our Noah Adam. So, Adam, he's extremely famous for digging his heels in, and uh, as usual, President Trump is showing zero sign of backing down on this issue. That's right, Mark. In an interview on Fox News on Thursday, President Trump praised his tariffs on Chinese imports. He said they've had a, quote, big impact in damaging China's economy, which he claimed has gone down substantially. Washington has so far imposed tariffs on $250 million worth of Chinese goods, with Beijing retaliating in kind. President Trump added he could do a lot more if he wanted to, but said he would prefer Beijing come to the negotiating table. He said although the Chinese want to negotiate, he does not believe they are ready. He also blamed previous U.S. presidents for allowing China to pursue unfair trade practices and said he had to tell Beijing, quote, it's over. Despite the rhetoric, however, tr Trump and Chinese President Xi Jinping are reportedly set to meet soon to try and defuse the tensions. The Wall Street Journal, citing officials in both countries, reported Thursday that the two leaders will meet at the G20 summit in Argentina late next month. The meeting was said to have been pushed by U.S. Uh, Treasury Secretary Stephen Mnuchin and White House economic adviser Larry Kudlow.